it's Annie cooking in the trailer park. Today we're going to be making a French toast, which is very simple. We're going to do it on the grill and we're doing it on our patio. So I'm walking in and here's Luigi. He's going to be helping me. I want to introduce my girls, Roxy and Ginger, and they are the wigs and everything. The clothes came from West Lake Resailers in Spring Park, Minnesota. They are the best place to go if you want vintage or anything. All right, so here we go. Louie, I'm going to put you in the trailer because I don't want you to cry. Okay, so I'm coming back here, getting ready, putting my apron on so I don't want to get greasy because there is oil and it has to go in very hot uh, into, I have a load pan, I have hala, and I will come back and show you how to mix all this together. And by the way, it's a beautiful day outside. Yes, it is. And this is Annie's garden. She loves right. gardening. So, so it's a we'll beautiful... see you in just a little bit. All right, I am back. I had to wash my hands and get some things set up. But we've got the barbecue now at almost 400, 350. And as you can see, I put the, the oil and everything in my pan. And don't trip, can you? Okay, so anyway, here's the challah. I am going to probably slice it. Uh, not real thin because you're making French toast. So you want it kind of thick. Okay, fine. All right, so now in my uh, concoction here of my mixture, I put three eggs and uh, it does need more milk. So, um, what did you put in besides the three eggs? Well, just a second. Okay, okay so, um, so I'm gonna put more milk because it doesn't look like it, need, it needs like a lot of milk, but you don't have to put real milk. I usually do flax, but I did, I ran out. Uh, cinnamon, just plain old cinnamon, and then just put it in there if the wind's blowing. And then a little bit of vanilla, just to give it a little sweetness or whatever. Okay. All right, so. Anyway, this is kind of what you do. You just mix it up. Very simple. It's a very, very simple dish. Not hard at all. Okay, so that's done. I forgot to bring the plate out here. Okay, so let me show you how this is uh, dipped. This is the problem of being in a small space. You don't have space. Okay, so. I'm going to dip, I'm going to put a little more milk in because it looks kind of eggy. So you kind of want it to be eggy, but not too thick of egg. You know, like you want it to kind of drip. See how it drips? Okay, dripping. So let's open this. You're going to dip your French, uh, I use challah, that I think is the best. I've tried brioche, but it falls apart. So your challah needs to be kind of, you know, uh, twisted, and then just let the batter run off. Oh, listen to that. That's going to make a nice French toast. So here we go. And... You don't need to soak your bread. You just have to kind of twist it around. So we got two big pieces in there. And now we're going to wait. I'll close that. And then we'll wait. And when we come back, I'll show you what it looks like. Hey, we're back. Thank you for my, uh, so much for watching me this morning. I'm going to uh, look at our um, toast, and it looks pretty done. Uh, we kind of had, we lost, uh, we had to put a new um, 
tank in, but as you can see, it's very well toasted and uh, ready to go to eat. But we're going to finish, I'm going to finish cutting up the, the uh, French toast. And now remember when you dip this, you don't want it, you know, to, you know, you don't want it sitting in your liquid. Okay. Let it drip. Put it in there. Okay. And you'll get some nice, crispy, wonderful French toast out of this. Um, and it's so easy, you guys. Really, it's so simple. It just takes a little bit of time, eggs, milk. Hey, Annie, don't forget to mention that you coated the, uh, the load pan with cooking oil. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, so... I use the, you know, I use kind of uh, vegetable oil instead of olive oil or any other kind of oil because it seems to do better on the hot, hot oil. Now I'm going to uh, close our Weber and we'll come back and we'll be sitting down to eat French toast. All right, I'm back. We are now going to sit down and eat our French toast that we made out in the trailer park on the patio on the um, barbecue. So, bon appetit, I hope you join me again. Have a great day.